Hello, my name is Millie Olu. I'm a Macmillan Oncology Dietitian working for Mid and South Essex NHS Foundation Trust. This presentation is about healthy eating after your cancer diagnosis. Do I need more advice? This topic is about general healthy eating. If you are experiencing any new symptoms which are affecting eating or causing concern, contact your GP, oncology team or healthcare professional who may refer you to the dietitian if appropriate. You may have already been told to follow a specific diet by your oncology team or dietitian as a result of your cancer diagnosis. It is important that you continue following this advice unless you have been reviewed. Why is healthy eating important? Now that you have been diagnosed with cancer, healthy eating can do the following things. Number one, provide your body with vital nutrition before and during any treatment that you may need. Number two, contribute to your recovery and help you to live well after a diagnosis of cancer. Number three, help maintain a healthy weight. Number four, help reduce the risk of any new cancers and other diseases such as heart disease, stroke and diabetes. The NHS Eat Well Guide. This shows the proportions of the main food groups that form a healthy, balanced diet. It can give you an idea of the amount of food that should come from each group. We can see that a large proportion of what we eat should come from starchy carbohydrate foods, e.g. bread, rice, potatoes, yams, cereals, etc. The other group which should contribute more of our diet is fruit and vegetables. Also on the slide you can see that there are protein foods in a slightly smaller section. These are also important as well as the dairy foods which are also in a smaller proportion. The smallest group of foods are the fats and oils. They are needed but in very small amounts. Practical tips for healthy eating. To achieve a healthy balanced diet you can try to eat higher fibre or whole grain starchy foods such as bread, cereals, chapatis, rice, pasta, noodles, potatoes, yam, cassava and couscous. Take regular energy by eating a starchy food at each main meal. Protein. Protein is needed for wound healing, repair and general working of our bodies. Take two to three portions of protein rich foods daily such as poultry, fish, lean meat, beans, pulses, eggs and nuts. Choose red or processed meats less often. Processed meat is meat that has been preserved by smoking, curing, salting or adding preservatives. Examples include sausages, bacon, ham, salami and pâtés. Limit your intake of these to no more than 70 grams per day, about 500 grams per week. More healthy eating tips. Eat at least five portions of a variety of fruits and vegetables every day. Include milk and dairy foods such as cheese, yogurt, fromage fray, non-dairy alternatives such as soya, oat or almond with added calcium and vitamin D. Choose unsaturated oils and spread such as olive, rapeseed and sunflower and use them in small amounts. If you are having food and drinks that are high in fat, salt and sugar, have these less often. 
Limit your alcohol intake and have one or two alcohol-free days each week. Alcohol is linked to increased risk of some types of cancer. The current recommendation for men and women is to take no more than 14 units a week. With thanks to the dietetic team, in particular the advanced head and neck dietitians and the advanced Macmillan dietitians,